But remember simple things like when entering a house and saying Bismillahir Rahmanir Rahim. Before entering the house, this stops the accompanying jinns from entering the house. These are the simple things for protection. Whenever you enter the house, you say Bismillahir Rahmanir Rahim. Whenever eating. Prior to eating, you say Bismillahir Rahmanir Rahim because the jinn partakes of the food. He eats with the left hand, his left hand, and he partakes of the food. He eats with the left hand, his left hand, and he partakes of the food, and there is less baraka blessings in the food. These are simple things which we are taught. These simple things are the things which protect people. Whenever you enter the house, say Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim, so the jinn do not enter the house with you and do not sleep in the house with you. Whenever you eat, say Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim, so they do not have any food from your house. Otherwise, if the jinn, so the jinn do not enter the house with you and do not sleep in the house with you. Whenever you eat, say Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim, so they do not have any food from your house. Otherwise, if the jinn partake of your food and live in your house, they will affect your house and they will cause dis disruption in your house. This is one of the main reasons that people have disruption is because they do not have the simple practices of the Sunnah of the Prophet is because they do not have the simple practices of the Sunnah of the prophetic way and from those simple, uh, simple practices it's saying Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim. Prior to performing everything, saying Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim. 